Okay, let's give you guys some more practice. So find the Maclaurin series for this function. So press pause and have a go. Okay, so to do this, we are going to make use of uh, of this. Um, so the trick is the trick is to rewrite this. Uh, the trick is to rewrite this as one block multiplying another block. So uh, so we are going to make use of this. Now this block here can be represented by by this series. So uh, so here you've got e to the power of negative two, and then this block here can be represented by this series. Can be represented by this series. So now um, now just rewrite this as one over e squared. So now uh, oops. So now you can just multiply this multiply in here. So that would then become that would then become this. So this is your final series, and this the series is valid for all um, for all x. Because, because if you go back to here, uh, this was our original function. So we visualized as one block multiplying another block. Well, th this block here is valid for all for all x for all x. So this here is just a constant. It's just a number. So if this block is valid for all x, then then when you when you times a constant, then it's valid for. So the whole thing will be valid for all x because of this. Be well, if this thing is valid for all x, then then when you times a constant, the whole thing will be valid for all x. Okay, so so this is your, hang on, this is your, uh, this is your final series, and it's valid for all x. Okay.